The tackle. This short video will give a clear description of the tackle allowed in ladies Gaelic football. Before we start, the key rule in the official guide, there shall be no deliberate body contact. A key word in this is deliberate. So for instance, if two players were jumping up to catch the ball, there may be contact but it is deliberate if one player pushes the other, for example. So the word deliberate is very important in this rule. In relation to the tackle, rule 396, a player while holding the ball into her body cannot be legally dispossessed. Any attempt to do so shall result in a free being awarded to her team. This is really important, so if a player has the ball in her body, she cannot be tackled. When making a tackle to dispossess a player of the ball, firstly, it must be timed when the player in possession has the ball out from her body. Secondly, the ball must be knocked from the opponent's hand by flicking it with the open hand or hands. And finally, it cannot use the fist at any time. So to tackle, you must wait till the ball is away from the body and then use the open hand or hands. Any attempt to tackle with the fist will be a minimum of a free against the player. It could possibly be a yellow card if it's a fist into the body of the player. If you look at this video, it's an excellent example of the tackle. The player in green chases back the player in red, waits till the ball is away from the body, uses the open hand and knocks the ball away. It is perfect timing. Watch this again. The ball is out from the body. The player waits till the ball is away, taps the ball with the open hand and wins possession. It is an excellent example of the tackle. If you watch this in slow motion, you will see that the player will wait till the ball is out, which will be every four steps, and can knock the ball in any direction away, as long as they use the open hand or hands. It does not necessarily need to be the near hand. The near hand tackle is a skill, but you can tackle with either hand, as long as you do not touch the body of the player. So you're looking for the timing and using the open hand. There can be no fist. This is another excellent example of the tackle. So watch the player in blue. We'll time it to when the player is about to kick it and then we'll knock the ball away with the open hand. Look for the timing, knocks the ball away and our team retains possession. So you're looking out for the timing of it, the open hand and making sure there is no fist going into the player. The key factors the referee will look at are the force, the intent and the movement of the player. So has the player moved and not made deliberate contact with the other player? So they're using that open hand and timing it, but they cannot make co deliberate contact with the opposition player. The intent, the intent is there to just knock the ball away with the open hand while it is away from the body. And the force the referee will look for to ensure that the hand or fist has not made contact with the body of an opponent, it is only making contact with the ball. So you cannot make contact with the body of an opponent. In this picture, you will see it can be difficult for a referee as both players are fouling as they're playing the body of an opponent. So it doesn't matter if you have or have not the ball, you cannot have deliberate contact with the body of an opponent. The referee will look for who makes this contact first in a situation as per the picture. The key principles in the art of tackling, the best tackler is the patient tackler. 
So wait and time your contact. The player has to do something within every four steps. So time that. Tackle with confidence when the time is right. So the ball is out of the body or the player is off balance. Body positioning is important. The player tackling should try and dictate the play. So head down, push to non-preferred side, down the line or away from the goal. Your objective is to delay and deny the player. Desire and commitment to tackle the ball and not the person. You're looking to dispossess. You cannot tackle the player. And remember, tackle smart. If you'd like to find out any more in relation to the tackle, we have a skill card on our website, www.ladiesgaelic.ie forward slash learn. Or if you go on the LGFA YouTube channel, there are webinars to help you coach the tackle and learn more about the tackle.